Well, hello, friend, and welcome to another episode of my 100 Day to Prosperity journey. My name's Tamisha, so glad to have you here with me today. Today, I'm going to talk to you about something that is trending. It's um, Ocean Ramsey. She's a marine biologist, and she happened to be swimming with a shark. I mean, really swimming with the shark. She actually was touching the shark and poking the shark and everything while they were swimming in this deep blue ocean in somewhere off of Hawaii. And um, I found that to be amazing for many different reasons. But the fact that she was doing this and had no fear, I mean, bold, you know, this 6,000 pound animal, 20 feet long, that could have turned at any moment and snapped at her and killed her and that would have been the end of it. You know, she was swimming with this beautiful fish and she was documenting things about the great white sharks that we don't really know about and basically putting it out there and showing her passion through video in her Instagram and I found this to be amazing for several different reasons um, and this is what I learned from her whole experience number one I learned that she loved her job and it's so important to love what you do I mean the passion and boldness that she has to go out there you know mil my miles offshore and to find these big majestic animals that are not you know friendly you know they're not <laughs> you know they're not you know docile in in the list in the least you know if the great white shark wanted her to stop bothering her all the shark had to do was turn and bite i mean you know to put your life on the line like that you have to have tenacity you have to want it you have to be passionate about it and so many of us are in situations where we don't have passion about what it is that we do when we wake up in the morning me included we dread going to work we feel like we don't want to do it matter of fact I had a horrible week last week and the main reason why was just because well mainly you know, the circumstances didn't lend itself to the best um, thought processes, but it was my fault. You know, I talked to you about living above the line, and last week I did not. You know, I fell very far below it because I was, you know, tired, and I didn't want to go to work. And, you know, I just couldn't dredge myself out of that funk. And I did. I took it out on the kids. I sure did. And I'm not proud of it. And I did some of the blaming game. Not really a lot of the blaming. But I did complain a lot. And, you know, it just was not a good week for me. And at the end of the week, Friday, I started having, you know, minor panic attacks. Especially since next week is going to be a full-fledged week where I'm going to have to do a whole lot of stuff, a lot of paperwork, and trying to, you know, get people to pass classes that they haven't passed all year so far. We're in the second semester. And, you know, being responsible for all of that stuff built stress. And to see Ocean Ramsey's story of how she just was without abandon she just went out there and did her job and loves it gave me hope that I can eventually get to that point too and you know I'm 37 years old I shouldn't be having stress panic attacks chest pains you know difficulty breathing because I just can't deal with the stress of work at that point it's time to find something else, okay? And if you're in that position where you dread going to work, or maybe you like your job, but the stress of it is so much that, you know, you have to pop pills just to make it through the day. You know, you have to, you know, 
drink a whole bunch of coffee just to get through the next meeting. You know, you your health is waning. You don't see your family. You're, you know, mad at the world. You need to take a really good look at your life and see, is what I'm doing worth it? Is what I'm doing, it might be making me money, but am I being prosperous? Am I prosperous? Is everything in my life thriving? Or am I just surviving? Am I just living paycheck to paycheck just to pay my bills, go to work, pay my bills, and just exist? And life isn't worth that. You weren't put on this earth just to exist. You weren't put on this earth to thrive. You were put on this earth to dominate. And if you're not doing that, if you're not being prosperous in your life, and I'm not just talking about financially, I'm talking about in every area of your life. If you're not living like Ocean Ramsey, where you can get up and live without abandon and live without fear and say, you know, screw the naysayers and the people in my community who says that what I'm doing is risky. I'm going to go out and I'm going to swim with this shark. If you're not going to, if you're not living like that, then you're not living. You're just existing. And who wants to do that? God wants something better for you. I want something better for you. And I hope you want something better for you. So if you found any value to what I just brought you, make sure that you, you know, click the like button down at the bottom. And please subscribe to my channel. You know, I'm giving daily wisdom tips to help you be successful. All of you entrepreneurs out there, all of those people who want to make a change for the better in your life. You know, I am the voice of reason helping push you through. So make sure that you, you know, stay on my journey. See what I do next. I guarantee you it's, it's a ride that you won't forget. Okay. Also, if you want to see what I'm doing, you know, you tired of your boss too, and you tired of your, your job too, and you want to see what I'm doing to fire my boss in 2019, make sure you click down in the description link. There is a link to what I'm doing, and I'm pretty sure if you can jive with me, you can jive with it, and we can do this together, okay? Um, but until next time, my friend, Make sure that you think big, dream big, take action to own the life of your business. Bye now.